Who you choose for your circle and your surroundings will directly impact your future. This your boy Soldier P, money making music in collaboration with High Point Promo. For all my fans and supporters, and for anybody in the world that could learn something from this, from my story. We're gonna bring it back a little bit, you feel me? Music, that is my life. It's been a part of my life since I was a kid. You feel me? Got to really get taking it seriously in high school and started doing talent shows, kind of writing my own raps, recording, getting the home studio thing going. You know what I'm saying? By the time 2010, 2009, 2010 roll around, things are going pretty good. You know what I'm saying? Make a little name for myself in my city, working hard. You know what I'm saying? Really kind of just developing who I was as an artist. And I think that's when it really happened. Like, people started to notice, you know, this is something he takes seriously. This is something he wants to do. This is, something, this is his passion, you feel me? So, it just so happens I got an opportunity to be in the studio with Lil Zane. And things worked out real well in that studio session to where I wanted a feature from him. And it turned into him signing me in the following months. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of good opportunities came my way. A lot of good things came my way. And you know what I'm saying? Along with the good always comes the bad. Like, you know, you could choose the right crew. You think you chose the right crew, but you don't really know until it comes down to the situation when you learn your damn lesson. You feel me? So it's like, and I always say it the same way for one reason. You know what I'm saying? I smoke in a blunt, October of 2014. Mind my own damn business, you feel me? Smoking a blunt. It's like God sent. Something told me I had to go to the kitchen. There wasn't no question. So I went. You know, guardian angel above, R.I.P. my mama. I went to the kitchen, and on the way, I went, looked out the window because one of the blinds was broke, you feel me? So I looked out the window and I seen someone coming up to the door. And then next thing you know, as my eyes meet their eyes, all I hear is like a boom, gunshot. And as the altercation is transpiring, what's going through my mind is, yeah, I'm smoking a blunt because this describes my personality, my persona. I'm a chill, laid back dude. I don't really go around looking for controversy, looking for drama. I'm a laid back dude. So it's like, you know, he's shooting at me through the window, through the front window. He's got two straps and I'm returning fire and my gun jams, life or death. And he starts coming in through the front window. And the only thing I could think is, you know, I pray to God, my guardian angel above, RP, my mama. And it's like adrenaline's completely taking over. You know, and unfortunately in this situation, someone lost their life and it really took a toll on me because it's like I've never been in a situation like this before. I never prepared myself to fight for my life. And it's just like during the investigation, they found a little something and I'm going to have to sit down. I'm going to have to do a little jail time. I'm facing a little time. And it's just like it makes me wonder if I would have chose not to have the fakes around me, would I even be in this situation? Now you're hearing from me right now about this two years later. A lot of you don't even know about this. You feel me? It's affecting me in a major way because back then, if I would have done the time, I was young and dumb and living that life. And now I do got some things going for me. You know what I'm saying? I got a lady at home. I got a team around me. You know what I'm saying? People done spent their time on me, their money on me, their effort on me. So we can propel this shit. And then I got to sit down. You feel me? So it's a lot of pressure not only just on myself. It's a lot of pressure on everybody. You know what I'm saying? The nights be the worst, man. Can't sleep, mind racing. You feel me? It's the night before, man. I got to be up in three hours. I don't even know what I'm doing up, but you feel me? It's just like, I got things to do. I can't just go to sleep, you know what I'm saying? I got responsibilities, you know what I'm saying? I got bills, I got submissions, contracts, label shit to handle, you know what I'm saying? I'm, so, I'm up talking to all the people in my label, every, every single member of the label. Cause it's like, you know, I'm going tomorrow. There ain't no time to fuck around. It's gotta get done. Everything's gotta get done from the top to bottom. Oh shit, you know, it's a lot of shit on my brain right now.
until my dying breath. I never let her up. 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 Thank you. What's your name? How old are you, Mr. Walker? How far did you go into school, sir?